Hey guys, Adam back with another blog post. Uh, today we're decoding advertising buzz buzzwords and the buzzword today is mobile optimization. You know, um, So our phones at this point are basically an extension of ourselves. And in fact, according to a recent report, nearly 60% of all online traffic is driven by smartphones. No surprise. So, But year after year, people are spending more and more time on their mobile devices and as the breadth of what the mobile devices can do for us continues to increase, so does their importance to the success of the marketing industry. You know, there's nothing more annoying than checking out a website on your desktop or laptop computer, leaving the house, trying to show a friend the same content you were just viewing and realizing the page is lagging because, you know, you're on your phone. You know, in this day and age, there's really no excuse for a differentiation in quality from device to device. Uh, and that's where mobile optimization comes in. In the simplest of terms, um, mobile optimization is the idea that visitors who are viewing your site from a mobile device like a phone or a tablet should have the same exact experience as the customer who's surfing the web at home from their desktop computer. Let's be honest, who has desktop computers anymore? Uh, but anyway, in order for you to web page to be successfully wired uh, to fit mobile devices specific needs, there are a few things you need to consider. Um, the things that annoy us about the internet are only emphasized when we deal with the same things on a smaller screen. Uh, a good example of that are pop-up ads. Sure, they're a pain regardless of what platform you're viewing them on, but on a phone, they're generally harder to quickly click out of simply because of size. So responsiveness is another common issue and because of Hardware issues, sometimes code needs to be modified to, be, to better fit with mobile devices. Simplify when you can. Get rid of pages with lots of redirects and the process will be a much smoother one for your customers. So like a lot of what we talk about on this blog, the smallest of changes can make all the difference. And almost any ad agency can put them into practice you know, relatively easily. And I can say from personal experience that when I visit a web page from my phone and I have a mobile optimization issue, I'm immediately left with a bad taste in my mouth for that brand and their products, regardless of all the positive experiences I may have had with them in the past. So take the time to do a quick audit of your site's responsiveness across all the platforms that your customers might be accessing them from. You'll be saving them a lot of headaches and increasing your brand image at the same time. So that's it for today. I'll see you guys next time.